Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the second part of the seminars on the LGBTQI plus plus mental health and well-being session organized by Vimans. The Mind Diaries is their official partner for the lecture series. Vimans has been organizing these lecture series on various mental health and well-being issues successfully for over a decade. As we get ready for today's seminar, we have one request. Besides, of course, requesting you to please put your phones on silent, we should also request you to leave behind all our inhibitions and explore our own beliefs, emotions, and enable better understanding and support to our own self and to those around and close to us. As a child, when I used to play with my siblings or friends in the neighborhood, I could never hide in dark and closed spaces, even though they make the best hiding spaces. As a grown adult, even today, I don't really like taking lifts or being in rooms like this that are enclosed. And, I mean, you know, the list can go on. And I'm sure you may identify this as common science or something called claustrophobia. And in that, there is a huge fear of enclosed spaces and can also cause huge panic to someone who's stuck inside a place like this, even if it's for a short time. Now just imagine if this space was someone's own body or own home. From all of us here in this room and so many outside in the world, sadly many have to live in spaces like this for quite a long time or for their entire lives. And that's something we will be exploring today. Ladies and gentlemen, today's speaker for the evening is Namata Gupta a queer affirmative psychotherapist and senior consultant clinical psychologist Vivans New Delhi, who will be speaking on this much misunderstood subject. The Mind Diaries, the official partner of, for the AIHC lecture series, is the first of its kind magazine in India on mental health and well-being. The magazine, which has been running for close to a year, aims to create awareness towards mental health and normalize seeking expert help. Besides first-person accounts of fighting back, there are also expert columns, inspirational stories, and a lot more. Before we hand the podium over to our expert, we request you to please keep your questions ready on the paper that's been provided to you on the table for our question-answer session, which will be scheduled for later. Over to Namata Gupta. Hi, good evening everyone. So, thanks for this question. Thank you for making it here on a weekend, starting weekend, Friday. So, several people want to rush home and not leave, I guess, until there's really a pressing need. So, thanks again. Um, so I would like to actually start a little bit by knowing our audience here so that we can become co-participants in today's discussion. Anyone who would like to just maybe your name or anything that you would like to talk about, something that you want to share or just throw out. Uh, let's consider an invisible bowl here. So if you want to throw out the word or something you would want to be attended to during the discourse today. I would like to keep it uh, by direction. So anything, a word, a color, a fear, or anything you relate as something which makes you feel it's you. It could be your name, or it could be your profession, it could be where you stay, or anything. Anyone who would be willing to start, uh, we'll have to actually shake ourselves. Or to us if you will go so let's keep it actually open discussion. Please. Hi, my name is Radhika. I'm, I'm very excited to be here. Just... Thanks, Radhika. Thanks for starting and breaking the ice. Yeah. Uh, welcome. I don't want to pick people. I will not do that. So please. <laughs> I'm Disha. And I'm a psychologist. And I'm coming with a lot of curiosity. Thank you. Yes. So curiosity. Thanks. Anyone? Anyone? Uh, first benches, last benches, which <laughs> you <laughs> Yeah. Hi, I'm Roshni. I'm a clinical psychologist. I'm really looking forward to today's session. Thank you, Roshni. Thank you. Thanks. Welcome. 